Welcome to Movie Inside Global, today, I am going to explain the American supernatural crime thriller film called Death Note. Spoilers ahead. Watch and enjoy. Movie begins with a teenage boy named Light Turner. He is at his high school campus going through his notes. All of a sudden, winds start blowing and a mysterious leather-bound black book falls from the sky. The book cover says Death Note and Light finds the book on the ground. Then it starts to rain and he sees a school bully harassing a student. Light confronts him and asks him to stop it and screams at him. Light gets punched in the face and is knocked down to the ground. A teacher finds that Light has been solving other students' homework. Then principal finds out and grounds Light for this. Light is kept in a room isolated as a punishment. He is frustrated by this punishment. Then he begins to read that book. This is no ordinary notebook. It says the human whose name is written in this will die. That person will die in the manner prescribed. There were also rules and regulations to keep this notebook. This notebook belonged to the death god named Ryuk. All of a sudden light goes off. He sees a big strange shadow in the room. It was not a human shadow but some creatures. Light then meets the death god Ryuk, the notebook's owner. Ryuk explains he is the death god, and he is the owner of this special book. Ryuk tells Light about the notebook and what it can do. There are some specific notes in this book that have been called death notes, and the keeper of this book is the owner of this notebook. It means, Light was the owner of this notebook at this time. The important fact of this notebook is that any human name written in this book will soon die. The owner of notebook can kill anyone by writing the name. Then the victim will die in the same manner specified in the book, but owner will have to follow some of the rules for doing so. Ryuk says that each death should be physically possible. Ryuk convinces Light to use the notebook. Death Spirit tells Light, you have to write at least a name in the notebook within seven days. If he does not write the name of anyone, the book will be taken away for disobedience. The condition to write the name of anyone in notebook is that he must know the face and real name of that person. Light wants to test the book and looks outside the window. The school bully who hit Light is harassing a student. Light writes down the name of that boy in the notebook. He writes the manner of death as decapitation. The we see two cars collide with each other. Thereafter he witnesses him being killed in a freak accident. Light is shocked to see the death unfold in front of him. Light realizes the power of the book. Light is very frightened. Ryuk tells him to keep the book. You can use the book as many times as he likes and if he doesn't use it for seven days, the book will be taken away. Soon after, Light returns home. Light and his father, who is a cop, are eating dinner. His father asks him that did he know the kid who died at school. Light says he did not know who he was. His father asks him about his punishment at school. Light gets angry and says he did not get the guy who killed his mother. Light is upset that his mother's killer got away. Then Light goes to his room and writes the name of the killer who killed his mother. Then the same man is shown who is having dinner with his buddies. All of a sudden, a freak accident kills him. Light's father tells him about the man's death and they seem happy. Light apologizes to his father for the misbehavior. Father tells him that he loves him and Light says I love you too. Then at school Light thinks how this notebook can be used to do good things. Then a girl named Mia comes to see him. Then they start to have a conversation. Light tells Mia about his secret, the notebook. That I have found a mysterious book. Any person name written in this book will die. But Mia does not trust him. Light shows me a live demonstration to prove it. A man holds hostage a woman at gunpoint. Light writes down the kidnapper's name in the notebook. And also, the manner the kidnapper is killed. A police van rams into him and killing him, the same way written in the book. Mia is shocked to witness it live. She cannot believe that something like this is also possible. Now they both are partners and have this great power at their disposal. Now they can end anyone's life anytime as they can find the criminals online and eliminate them. Change the world for better. Though they start to eliminate them one by one. The notebook's owner can hold sway over the dying person. Light shows as a name as Kira, killer in Japanese. As Light used to leave a message Kira whenever someone died, to send a message to all criminals that Kira will come after them. That Kira has arrived to end all criminals and wrongdoers. This news goes viral across the world. That a serial killer Kira has come, who is continues to kill every criminal, and some people starting to support Kira. The police want to catch Kira as he is spreading terror. Light and Mia are happy of what they have achieved. Then an intelligent investigator takes up this case. 
That investigator's name is L who is known to solve difficult cases. Light and Mia are really happy with their achievement. L makes a press conference. He says Kira is a person who is coward and a child, and he will be meeting Kira face to face shortly. L tells James that Kira can kill only those people whose identity is in public records. Light and Mia are upset that they cannot get this cop who is hiding his identity. This cop is smart and they have to be cautious from now on. Light asks his father what happens when they catch Kira. Light's father tells he has killed over 400 people and half of them want to hang him and another half want to investigate how he did it. Hearing it, Light gets a little anxious. His father is upset that L has assigned an agent to follow his son. Light notices some guy is following him and tries to lose him. He tells Mia that he has been followed. And they have to be quiet for some time until police stop following him. Mia says we are the good guys and they want to stop us. She tells Light to get rid off all the agents, so they know the cost of messing with Kira. Light does not want this and they both argue. He tells her it's his book and his decision not kill people for some days. L gets a call stating all his agents are committing suicides. We see all the agents jumping off the building. Kira is held responsible for all these deaths. Light is upset as he has not written their names in the book and Ryuk is responsible for all the killings. He confronts Ryuk and questions did you kill those FBI agents? Ryuk tells him that book is causing light problems and to give up the book so that it can find a new owner. Light's father gives out a public warning to Kira. He says Kira is coward as he kills innocent people, challenges Kira to kill him and he is not afraid of him. After watching the news on TV, Mia tells Light to write down his father's name in the notebook. Light says are you out of your mind, he is my dad. We are not killing anybody and this is over. L is the mastermind behind this. He wants to see if Kira kills Detective James. He has the suspicion that Light is Kira. L applauds James' bravery. L meets with Light at restaurant and asks him, was it a difficult decision? Not to kill his father as he knows Light is Kira. He also reveals his face and warns him. Light runs back home and Rain and Mia is waiting for him. Mia tells she is sorry and not ready to lose him. And she loves him. Light says L's right-hand man will know L's real name. Light writes down the name of L's friend in that notebook. And he gets control of him. There is rule in the notebook, which states, the person will not die if the owner burns the page before the set time of the death. Ryu tells him that, only one name can be removed by burning it. Now what Ari was under Light's control, but he says he do us not know L's real name as he was brought up in orphanage. So Light tells him to travel immediately to the orphanage and get L's information. What Ari travels to the orphanage, Light plans to burn the notebook page with Watari's name to stop Watari's death and then kill L, but L suspects Light is responsible for Watari's missing, and he comes to Light's house without informing. He tells Light's father that his son is real Kira. He thoroughly searches Light's home for evidence, and he finds no evidence against him, as Mia helps to sneak the notebook out before the search. Then Light receives the call from Watari who says, I have reached orphanage. He goes through the records to find L's information, but Light cannot find the page in the notebook. That Watari's name is written on. Watari is then killed by security for trespassing before he can reveal L's name. At school dance, Mia tells she took Watari's page. Moreover, I had also written the name of agents in that notebook causing their deaths. She tells, I have also written your name in that notebook now, and set to kill him at midnight by stopping his heartbeat. But she offers to burn his page if he turns the notebook over to her. When L learns about his friend's death and becomes unstable, he goes to arrest Light. But a Kira supporter, hearing that Light is Kira, knocks L out, letting Light escape. He meets Mia and they ride to the top of Giant Wheel. Meantime, police also reach there. Light says to Mia, if you love me don't take the book. And we can run away together and not use the book again. Mia disagrees with him. She steals the notebook from Light. But Mia realizes that it was Light's plan. Light has written her death in the notebook. If she takes the book, the Ryuk makes the wheel collapse. Mia falls to her death, but Light survives the fall into the water. We see the page with Light's name lands in a burning barrel. Light is hospitalized and is in coma. Someone returns the book to him. Prior to meeting Mia, Light had used the book to get doctor's help. To rescue him and put him into induced coma. 
Another criminal recovers the death note and continue Kira's killings before returning the book to him. Light had acted wisely. As when he knew that Mia had written his name in the notebook. Then he writes Mia name in the book, that if she takes the book she will die. After this, L is taken off the case, but he raids Mia's house and finds the notebook page. With FBI agent's name on it. So all the blame is on Mia. Light has recovered completely and has notebook in his possession. Please like, share and subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.